Hi guys, this is Arshad Qureshi and welcome to my training video and I hope uh, you are enjoying my video and this is English language video today again. There are more videos in English language on my uh, channel. Go to the playlist. There is a playlist called English language videos and you can go and you can browse many videos over there and I'm sure you are practicing on those as well. If you haven't subscribed my channel, please do subscribe. Today's video is very interesting. You remember a uh, few videos back I I uploaded a video I explained to understand the line of the white ball from the blue spot to the balls on the cushion but today is a kind of an advanced practice uh, I would say a very advanced practice but very necessary for the players who are actually working or, or trying to improve their game to uh, the other level so today we are going to play the same practice from the black and then trying to cannon our white ball on the yellow, green, brown, blue, pink, black. <laughs> Again, it's a, it's a tough practice. I know uh, there will be a lot of sides to be used. There's a lot of uh, pace, understanding. You will miss many times. It's not easy. Try with one ball, try with two, three, four. And once, trust me, if once you are confident in it, uh, hitting the all balls as you predicted in your mind, as you played uh, when you were uh, about to hit as you as you thought of the shot it played perfectly and then you can see the good results in your game of judging your white balls line where it's going after hitting your uh, after potting the object ball so this actually this practice actually improves your two things one the potting practice is obviously your potting of the ball the judging of the line of aim correctly with and without sides again we are going to judge with the white ball uh, where we are going to place I will explain once I start the video but before I start my video if you haven't subscribed my channel please do subscribe it always share my videos if you want one-to-one -one training if you want to invite me to your country for your uh, association for your national team for junior camps I do travel to different countries contact me my numbers are there if you want to invite me to your club for your club players or for one-to-one -one, uh, training do invite me I do visit different uh, as per my schedule different time so let's start today's video and let's hope you get you learn a lot from today's video which is very interesting and exciting okay guys let's start this practice and I'm going to place my white ball wherever I want wherever you think is going to be correct place it and then use one cushion and touch your white ball let the white ball cannon onto the yellow and then green then brown and then blue this is a very difficult practice very advanced practice and you need to have a very good queuing if you are not confident on the potting always practice with the pot and then go into this shot this shot is with right hand side and let's see if i can cannon yellow okay so it means this was too much side. Almost hit uh, uh, an inch away from the yellow. Let's keep playing this shot until unless you know where you are hitting. These practices are very advanced and very important for improving your game. Otherwise, trust me, you guys are just be wondering around what's happening. Okay. All right. All right. So it means I, this before I was a bit short second short I was a bit over let's play the different judgment this time it's right hand side put the chalk on and beautiful so it was a very good shot As you can see, so I have achieved my first short angle. Let's do another practice. 
another shot on the green ball again place it wherever you feel it's going to hit play the same shot now there's going to be more side most of the shots are going to be with side that's why I'm saying this is very advanced practice and the players who are uh, struggling uh, in potting practices or they, they are struggling with the sides first they go to improve their potting skills with sides then they can come onto this again this is a difficult practice trust me for any any top players it's a difficult practice but there is no escape from it you have to do it whoever you are okay this is looks good very nice so we did cannon the blue I, it slipped off and the ball. So after the green ball let's start with the brown ball and uh, it's more difficult than that but probably less side is required but again the control is not easy and let's see if I can hit it in first attempt that's good that's very good concept okay now let's go for blue it's a difficult shot we have achieved the target of yellow green brown now it's blue let's see if I can do it in first attempt or how many attempts voila very nice so now it's time for the pink the further it's going the, the more get it's getting difficult why because the white ball has to travel more it is decreasing you need less side but you need more accurate in your pace and your white ball travel keep you again I mentioned again and again that keep your white ball where you feel it will go and hit the blue ball, pink ball. Let's see. Whew, that's good. okay I want you guys again I'm saying this I want you guys to play this shot at least five times four times three times you know the player only gets on the top level whoever put efforts effort his very hard work and efforts in his practice without this without practice without hard practice snooker is nothing okay let's hit black ball okay this time I'm a bit over I was a bit conscious that maybe my white ball is not going to reach okay less side there was I'm going to increase the side this time it looks better and there we go okay guys so uh, after this practice you have realized the snooker is not an easy sport and it takes years of hard work and practice for the players who are actually playing well and you see them on the television or in the top amateur competitions or pro am com they take a lot of time they spend a lot of time understanding the importance of the game the importance is what 
the understanding the line of aim understanding the line of their white ball to keep and make their breaks consistent and keep them uh, regular and uh, what we do we never i don't know tell me how many players have tried this practice not many or how many players have tried previous practices there are few who really want to improve and that's the whole idea of the game if you are waiting for a miracle it's not going to happen you have to be on the table on the practice table not just the game people watch a video they see and they say okay we understand it or we'll do it but they never do it if you spend three days four days achieving this practice it's not easy i've done it because uh, i'm a decent player i've i've been playing this for a long time so it was possible but it's not possible for every player you will not be succeeding uh, you will not succeed in first attempt first two three attempts or maybe first two three days but the player who stick to this or he takes it as a challenge will be the player who will be competing in big events so uh, thank you very much for this video before leaving please subscribe my channel if you want to have one-on-one -on -one training in your country if you want to invite me in your country for your players if you want to invite me to your city to your uh, club for your team for yourself for one to one please leave me a message or whatsapp message on the on the numbers on the screen on the tag and uh, if you need a snooker table or any help for or any questions do contact me I always reply reply sometimes it does uh, takes some time because i'm mostly i'm busy and i get so many emails messages and every different mediums from the from my uh, social media contacts so but i always reply so take care of your health if your family and your city your community and uh, may allah bless you all take care bye